was. Oh my god! That's so deep! Holy shit! Crikey! <laughs> oh my god! My feet are so wet! Holy shit! Crikey! G'day folks, shitlers and blokes, and uh, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be reviewing my new pads, uh, elbows and knees, and um, some new gloves that I got. So the ones I got, I have a iron scrub amp glove in a size small, and it, like, I don't know what's going on with the sizes, but I have big hands, and some people must have very big hands, because me being as small is something weird. Um, I also have the... Iron E trays elbow pads, which are fabulous, and the Iron K trays amp zip knee pads, which are awesome as well. So I hope you guys enjoy. This will also have some footage from just us riding today, uh, riding the other day because we had a fat time and it was muddy as hell. Um, so I hope you guys enjoy and um, like, subscribe. If you have any questions, put them in the comments, and um, I hope you guys stick around for the next one. Um, I ordered my pads from Mountain Biking, Mountain Bike Direct, Mountain Biking Direct, whatever. Um, they came within a week, which is pretty good in our current climate with coronavirus and all. Um, and they came with a lot of packing, they weren't damaged, they were really well packed. And um, honestly though, I actually probably killed some turtles with how much packing. If you follow my Instagram story, you would have seen. And if you don't, go get Instagram and go follow it now because I do some dumb shit on there sometimes. So um, we actually unintentionally ended up riding for three and a bit hours um, and in that whole time, except for right when I put it on, um, I didn't get itchy or anything from these pads and I figured that right when I put it on is from new. Um, and I get, um, when material bunches up in like my elbows and stuff, it gets really bloody annoying. So um, I specifically bought these pads because they have that gap right on where your elbow joins on the inside um, and it seemed to work really 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 well for me so if you guys have that problem that's something to look for I'm not saying get these ones but these ones are bloody good um, yeah but otherwise three hours worth of pedaling up hills all that sort of stuff the gloves are super breathable I didn't really get all that sweaty in them and um, the grip on them actually is like sticking glue to my grips which is fabulous because it means I'll have no more stacking if you haven't seen that video um, I'll probably put a little information thing up in the top right corner if I don't I'm sorry I've forgotten go check it out um, and the the elbow pads were fabulous they had really good ventilation and the same as the knee pads I will do a little bit more later in the video um, but just for now, um, I think we might do some cinematic shit. In summer, 
um, I would 100% recommend these pads if you were looking to buy them because they are fabulous. They don't slip down. They don't bunch up. The gloves are absolutely amazing. They grip onto my grips very, very, very well. Um, and that's about it. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, if you don't, subscribe right now because I need to get to a few subs so I can start getting monetized for this. Um, I'd also like to apologize for the strap and the water tube <laughs> that was swung in front of the camera for the whole time. Um, well, not the whole time, some of the time. Um, and make sure you guys go and follow all the socials in the link below. I'd just like to say also a huge shout out to the people who helped me film this. Uh, Luke, James, Joshy, Travis, myself, and another mate that was with us. Um, so huge shout out to them because they really helped me with this video. Um, and I will see all you guys in the next one, I would hope. Um, like, subscribe, and see you later. Oh,